DJ Mosley. Mm. Um, that guy, when I, I remember we were running a power play, uh, running a power play, and he got caught in traffic. I was I was the pulling guard, so I skipped pull, go in the gap, and he got caught in traffic and completely lost where I was. And and when he finally got out, I had just a perfect clean shot on him. Got him. I mean, it, uh, the best hit, probably highlight of my career. <laughs> that's 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 how good of a hit it was. And then Neil Brown calls a duo, which means we're going to run that same play again. I don't know what I did. I don't know if there was some sort of gift or whatever it was, but Mosley all of a sudden saw me. He looked at something and he starts screaming, pulling guard, pulling guard. And I'm like, and dude, I, I don't, I usually don't give, I don't give a tell that what I'm about ready to do. And this dude knew exactly what I was about ready to do. And he jackknifed the play. He just added on blitz and hit Ray Ray in the backfield and made me look like a fool. I went from cloud nine to dirt four <laughs> real quick. It's just a stint of two drives by him. But that's how, they are so adaptive. And that was because of Nick Saban. That, that was his mantra. It, it was living in that film room. It wasn't just relying on just your sheer talent. It's knowing the game. Front, uh, front, uh, right to left, front to back, dead center, 